Good day, everybody. This is Dr. Nandi. I'm back again. Today, I'm going to talk about a statistics hypothesis test with population standard deviation known. Okay. So without further ado, I'll share my screen with you. Hypothesis test for the mean with population standard deviation known. The mean salary of federal government employees is 59,593. The average salary of 30 state employees who do similar work is 58,800 with population standard deviation sigma equal to $1,500. At the point zero one level of significance, can it be concluded that the state employees earn on the average less than the federal employees. So the alternate hypothesis or the test hypothesis is H1 colon mu population mean less than federal government employee salary 59,593. So this is a left tail test because the two slanted lines indicating less than sign meet at an edge pointing to the left. The null hypothesis, of course, mu equal to 59,593. Sample size n is 30. Sample mean of the state employees is 58,800. Sigma is 1,500. Alpha is 0 0.01. What is alpha? Level of significance, which is the maximum probability of rejecting H0 when it is true. This is a left tail test because mu less than alternate hypothesis mu less than 59,593. So first we will find out the minus C alpha, which is the critical value in the left tail, which separates the reject H0 region from do not reject H0 region. So we will be using a TI-84 calculator. Second, press the second button, then the verse, which is in the third row, then select number three in norm, that is area on the left is given, which is 0 0.01 and mu is zero, sigma is one. Since we are dealing with standard normal curve, we bring the cursor down on PEST and hit enter and enter. Minus Z alpha is the minus 2.326. This is called critical value of Z because it separates the reject H0 on the left of it from the do not reject H0 on the right of it. Now we will calculate the test statistic, which is how far the sample mean is located from the hypothesized population mu zero, standardized or divided by the standard error or the standard deviation of the sampling distribution. So Z is equal to in parenthesis 58,800 sample mean minus the hypothesized population mean 59,593, close the parenthesis, divided by left parenthesis, 1500 is the population standard deviation, divided by second x square, which gives me the square root of 30. So first I press the second button, then x square gets the square root 30 and close the right parenthesis and then hit enter. Then we get a test statistic z value of minus 2.895. This means the sample mean 58,800 is located below the population mean, hypothesis population mean of 59,593 by 2.895 times the standard error. Why below? Because the sign is negative of Z. So since the test statistic of minus 2.895 is less than the critical value, minus 2.326, we reject the null hypothesis. Conclusion at alpha equal to 0 0.01, there's enough evidence to support the alternate H1, which is mu less than 59,593. I will stop here today. If you have any question, please uh, do not hesitate to contact me. And you can write a comment at the bottom of the screen, hit the comment button, and I will get back right back to you. Also, please subscribe to my channel. I come back every week and solve new problems in all kinds of math. I want to help you to succeed in math. So take care, have a nice day, and please subscribe to my channel. See you next time.